the instability created in Europe by the First World War set the stage for another international conflict, World War II. The conflict involved virtually every part of the world during the years 1939 to 1945 between the Axis powers of Germany, Italy and Japan and the allies of Great Britain, France, the United States, the Soviet Union and to a lesser extent China. Hitler's invasion of Poland in September 1939 drove Great Britain and France to declare war on Germany, marking the beginning of World War II. Among the estimated 45 to 60 million people killed were 6 million Jews murdered in Nazi concentration camps as part of Hitler's diabolical final solution. Hello there everyone, Momos Najmi here and today I have for you 25 interesting facts about World War II. So let's get straight into it. Number 1. The country with the largest number of World War II casualties was Russia with over 21 million. 80% of Soviet males born in 1923 didn't survive World War II. That is insane. Number 2. It is estimated that 1.5 million children died during the Holocaust. Approximately 1.2 million of them were Jewish and tens of thousands were Gypsies. Even after the Allies arrived, many concentration camp prisoners were beyond help. In Bergen-Belsen, for example, 13,000 prisoners died after liberation. Nearly 2,500 of the 33,000 survivors of Dachau died within six weeks of liberation. Number 3. Approximately 600,000 Jews served in the United States Armed Forces during World War II. More than 35,000 were killed, wounded, captured or missing. Approximately 8,000 died in combat. However, only two Jewish soldiers were awarded the Medal of Honor in World War II. Number 4. During World War II, the Japanese launched 9,000 wind ship weapons or paper and rubberized silk balloons that carried incendiary and anti-personnel bombs to the US. More than 1,000 balloons hit their targets and they reached as far as Michigan. The only deaths resulting from a balloon bomb were six Americans, including five children and a pregnant woman, on a picnic in Oregon. Number 5. The swastika is a sacred religious symbol in Hinduism, Buddhism and Jainism and dates back to before the 2nd century BC. The swastika is an ancient religious symbol. It derives from the Sanskrit name for a hooked cross which was used by ancient civilizations as a symbol of fertility and good fortune. It has been found in the ruins of Greece, Egypt, China, India and Hindu temples. Number 6. The Japanese kamikaze divine wind tactic was suggested on October 19, 1944 by Vice Admiral Onishi in an attempt to balance the technological advantage of invading American forces. Though the numbers are disputed, approximately 2,800 kamikaze pilots died. They sunk 34 US ships, damaged 368 killed 4,900 soldiers and wounded 4,800. Number 7. Many Jews were subject to gruesome medical experiments. For example, doctors who bombard the testicles of men and the ovaries of women with x-rays to see the impact of different doses on sterility. Nazi doctors would break bones repeatedly to see how many times it would be done before a bone could not heal. They hit people's heads with hammers to see what their skulls could withstand. Experiments were conducted to determine the effects of atmospheric pressure on the body. Prisoners were injected with different drugs and diseases 
and limbs were amputated and muscles cut for transplantation experiments. Today, reference to or use of the Nazi research is considered unethical. Dr. Joseph Mengele, the angel of death, used about 3,000 twins, mostly Romani and Jewish children, for his painful genetic experiments. Only about 200 survived. His experiments included taking one twin's eyeball and attaching it on the back of the other twin's head or changing the eye color of the children by injecting dye. In one instance, two Romani twins were soon together in an attempt to create conjoined twins. In addition to Jews and Gypsies, Jehovah's Witnesses were also persecuted and murdered in German concentration camps. Number 8. During World War II, the acronym BAM stood for Broad-Assed Marines or Women Soldiers in the US Marine Corps. The women, however, called the men HAMS for Hairy-Assed Marines. Number 9. The Nazi killed millions of Poles, but they thought that some Polish babies and children looked German and kidnapped about 50,000 of them to be adopted by German parents to become Germanized. Number 10. Several famous actors were decorated during World War II. For example, Henry Fonda won a Bronze Star in the Pacific. Walter Matthau was awarded six battle stars while serving on a B-17. And David Niven was awarded the US Legion of Merit. Christopher Lee was a pilot in the Royal Air Force and also won a number of awards. John Wayne starred in 14 World War II movies. However, due to a football injury, he never actually served in the war. Number 11. The most decorated unit ever in US history is the 442nd Regimental Combat Team, whose motto was Go For Broke. It consisted of Japanese-American volunteers Together, they won 4,667 major medals, awards, and citations, including 560 silver stars, 28 of which had oak leaf clusters, 4,000 bronze stars, 52 distinguished service crosses, and one medal of honor, plus 54 other decorations. It also held the distinction of never having a case of desertion. Number 12. The greatest tank battle in history occurred between the Germans and Russians at the Kursk salient in Russia from July 4 to 22 in 1943. More than 3,600 tanks were involved. Number 13. The now iconic We Can Do It poster was initially not intended for public display and only a small number of people saw it when it was first published in 1942. It only gained popularity in the 1980s when the feminist movement appropriated the image. Number 14. In 1974, a Japanese soldier named Hiro Onoda came out of the jungle of the Pacific island of Lubang. He had been hiding there for 29 years, unaware that his country had surrendered. Number 15. Author Ian Fleming based his character 007 on the Yugoslavian born spy Dusko Popov. Popov spoke at least five languages and came up with his own formula for invisible ink. He was the first spy to use microdots or photos shrunk down to the size of dots. He obtained information that the Japanese were planning an air strike on Pearl Harbor but the FBI did not act on his warning. Popov later lived in the United States in a penthouse and created a reputation as a playboy. He wrote an account of his wartime activities in his novel Spy, Counter Spy in 1974. Number 16. From 1942, US Marines in the Pacific used the Navajo language as their secret code. The language didn't have the vocabulary for existing World War II technology, so existing words had to be given new meanings. For example, the word for hummingbird 
Dahe Tihi became code for fighter planes. Around 400 Navajo Indians, code talkers, were trained to use the code, and the Japanese never cracked it. Number 17. The oleander is the official flower of the city of Hiroshima because it was the first to bloom again after the explosion of the atomic bomb in 1945. Number 18. Of the more than 2,900 Royal Air Force pilots who served in the Battle of Britain, around 2,350 were British. The rest, 550 or so, were natives of Commonwealth territories, such as Canada, Australia, New Zealand and South Africa, as well as expatriates from Poland, Czechoslovakia, Belgium and other countries under Nazi occupation. There were even a handful of American pilots, most notably Billy Fisk, a 29-year-old sportsman who had previously won a gold medal for bobsledding at the Winter Olympics. The international contingent proved especially deadly in the cockpit. The war cabinet created two Polish fighter squadrons, numbers 302 and 303, in the summer of 1940. These were followed by other national units, including two Czech fighter squadrons. The Polish number 303 fighter squadron downed 126 German planes during the battle, more than any Allied unit, and the RAF's top scoring ace was Joseph Frantisic, a Czech aviator who single-handedly claimed 17 aerial victories. Number 19. Hitler was found guilty of treason and sentenced to five years in Landsberg prison, where he dictated Mein Kampf to fellow prisoners Emil Morris and Rudolf Hels. This was obviously before the start of the Second World War. On 20th of December 1924, having served only nine months, Hitler was released. Rudolf Hess Hitler's deputy in the Nazi party was the last person to have been incarcerated in the Tower of London. Number 20 While in prison, Adolf Hitler envisioned the development of a people's car or a Volkswagen. From the word Volk meaning people or nation. On May 28, 1937, the government of Germany under National Socialist Party or the Nazi party, formed a new state-owned automobile company. Hitler's pet project was the development and mass production of an affordable yet still speedy vehicle that could sell for less than 1,000 Reich marks, about $140 at the time. To provide the design for this people's car, Hitler called in the Austrian and German automotive engineer Ferdinand Porsche, the founder of Porsche. Number 21 During one of the battle's most frantic periods of fighting over London, Royal Air Force Sergeant Ray Holmes spotted a German Dornier bomber headed in the direction of Buckingham Palace. Holmes had already used up all his ammunition in an earlier dogfight, but rather than retiring, he stared his Hawker Hurricane straight at the enemy aircraft and rammed it with his wing. The blow sliced the Tornier's tail clean off and sent it plummeting into nearby Victoria Station. Holmes' hurricane was also wrecked, but he managed to bail out and land dangling from the roof of an apartment complex. The astonishing incident was partly captured on film, and Holmes was hailed as a national hero for having saved the royal residence from potential disaster. Number 22 The British developed an air defence network that would give them a critical advantage in the Battle of Britain. The Dowding system, named for Fighter Command's Commander-in-Chief Sir Hugh Dowding, brought together technologies such as radar, ground defences and fighter aircraft into a unified system of defence. The RAF organized the defense of Britain into four geographical areas called groups, 
which were further divided into sectors. The main fighter airfield in each sector, the sector station, was equipped with an operations room from which the fighters were directed into combat. Number 23. In order to keep city children safe from bombs, many of them were evacuated to the countryside in England. Some children found this scary and hated being away from home, but some really enjoyed the opportunity to have new experiences. Some children from London had never seen cows before. However, this mass displacement of children caused a lot of distress, as you can imagine. Lasting over the duration of the war, some only seeing their parents once every few months and some never seeing their parents again as their parents died in the war. As well as British children, efforts were made to take Jewish children and other vulnerable children out of the mainland Europe so they couldn't be attacked by the Nazis. This was known as Kinder Transport and people like Sir Nicholas Winton worked tirelessly to help as many children escape as possible. Judith Kerr, the famous children's author, was just one child who fled to the UK during the war. Sadly, not all children were saved. Number 24 The youngest person to serve in the US Armed Forces was 12 years old. His name was Calvin Graham. He was wounded in battle and given a dishonorable discharge for deceiving the Navy about his age. An act of Congress later restored the benefits due to him as a veteran. Number 25 and the last one. Kiska, one of the Aleutian Islands of Alaska, was invaded by 35,000 US and Canadian troops on August 15, 1953. In the landing, 21 soldiers were killed under heavy bombardment, but there was no enemy. The expected Japanese had completely abandoned the island. Casualties were from friendly fire and booby traps. Reverend Martin Nemoller, a German theologian and Lutheran pastor, best known for his opposition of Nazi regime and imprisoned in camp for seven years, said, First, they came for the communists, and I did not speak out because I was not a communist. Then they came for the socialists and I did not speak out because I was not a socialist. Then they came for the trade unionist and I did not speak out because I was not a trade unionist. Then they came for the Jews and I did not speak out because I was not a Jew. Then they came for me and there was no one left to speak out for me. That is all I have for you today. These were the 25 interesting facts about World War II. Until next time, take care, be good, and thank you so much for listening.